Hey everybody, this is Joe, Joe's Premium Firewood, coming to you live on November 9th, 2023. We're out here in my cherry, cherry uh, storage area, which is along the barn. Hopefully we're coming in uh, in the horizontal view and not the uh, vertical view like last time. As you can see, Mike's already started, started sorting his load. He, he must have been playing games when he loaded this. Because uh, usually I like, you know, if you're going to bring a mixed load, what's going on, Jeffrey Weiss? Um, when you bring a mixed load, it should be like cherry, ash, oak. Well, here, here's what we got. We got cherry, we got oak, we got ash, we got cherry, we got ash, we got sassafras. So, sounds good. Is it horizontal or is it vertical? Somebody. Oh, who is that? Oh. Brad McGurk's here. Hi, Brad. Firewood at the furnace. There he is, Mr. 10,000 subscribers, Mr. Axis himself. We got, the, we got, we're team blue, uh, blue and orange here too, Brad. We got the old ultra, and I know if you would have got it, you would have. This would be a perfect machine for uh, for doing limb wood. Except, you know, you get big logs where I make these guys, you know, get it down to manageable size. So the game plan for right now is uh, we're he's got the oak here, and we're gonna start end of the cherry pile, and the horizontal. All right, thanks, thanks Rogala. Rogala's here. Say hi to Rogala. Hi. Say I hope you're feeling better. Yeah, I hope I feel better. Yeah, he's got, he, yeah. Listen to his voice. He's crackly, but no Henry Sam Squatcher. <laughs> Shimel, they haven't showed up yet. So I'm gonna set this up here. We're going to be going all over the place. We're going to put the, get the cherry here. The oak goes back there, and then the ash goes on the other side of the house, or I mean barn. So I'm going to have to be moving around. We don't have no Zach today. Zach didn't want to work. He wanted to play games, even though I gave him a, non, a no game playing hat like I'm wearing today. So, all right, Mike, uh, you, does mo most of that, is that already uh, doesn't need to be split. Some of it needs to be split. So I fire up the splitter, and then uh, I'll start stacking them over there. See, yeah, it looks like we got a pretty good camera angle. So we just got to, you know, I got to be organized around here. And like I say, it's a lot easier to sort it when you're loading the truck than, uh, than when you come here. But we'll be all right. We'll get, we'll get her done. Whether we got to play games or not, we'll get it done. Set them here and I'll stack them. Uh. Hey, Craig Wilson. Craig Wilson's going to be here too. Mike likes Craig. But we're going to have to dig the ones out of the front, so we might have to shut the splitter off when we do that. That's going to take a minute. Gotta restock for next year. I got it. I got my truck ready to load up and have Mike help me do that before he leaves. Yeah, if you could stack them too, if you, you see the ones that need to be stacked, Mike. When I when I keep a species separate, then like I say, they have to. I can't have any other species like oak go in with this cherry, because people will be buying it just because they want cherry. A lot of these are one poppers. I think Mike said he had this already split. You had the split for somebody that and then they never got back to you. Because somebody, somebody did ask me if my, if you sell wood to your own customers, said sometimes you do. 
But yeah, it rained all night again. Probably upper 40s. Pretty windy, but we're, the wind's coming out of the northwest, so we're not in the wind right here. We're definitely not playing games. Once we once we get some of this out of there, then we got room to move it around to. My brother got mad that we were like sorting his wood out, you know, taking the the stuff up to my mom or putting the big stuff in the boiler wood. And I'm like, where are we supposed to put it? If he would have just sorted it. If he would have just sorted it in the first place, like I do. You know, got a pile. You you, you see us when we're splitting. Some goes into boiler wood and some goes for my mom and then the good stuff I go to sell. Yeah. Right, Mike? Oh yeah. Got any long ones? Need for the bot here. Need for the bottom. I guess there's no no boards for it to sit on right here. It's just a small spot. There's a good one. Oh, you want thick? Double the duty. Double whammy. Yeah. Some of this cherry is dry. My dry cherry that I got to sell over there, about a half quart of it. That was a little bit rotted. I'll give that one to mom. a little bit earlier than uh, the video we did on Tuesday. We had like 60 people watching at one time. Maybe, maybe you guys like that vertical format better. It's not bad when you watch it on your phone, but if I don't know it's go if I don't know if it's happening, you got to have the, the camera perfectly set. And usually when when you uh, when you try to film in horizontal and it's vertical, it'll say rotate the camera, but it, it didn't do that. And uh, I guess Bill Moon said something, Craig Wilson said something, but when I'm over here, I can't see what you're saying. So you got to tell me like right away. And then every time I was behind the camera, people would just say, hi, Joe. Wouldn't say, hey, your feet you know, screwed up. But once I was like 20 minutes in, I wasn't going to start over. Just gonna finish it. Is 
that it? Now we got to dig the ones out from the front. This will be fun. But oh, you found another one. Is there more back in that corner? That's all oak. Well, let me throttle down. Now we got to do the fun part. Let's save gas. See how many people are watching. Hit that thumbs up. Where you guys can see. There's Denise Williams. Denise Williams says, nice load of wood, Mike. That's sassafras. This is oak. And that, there's ash. So we'll have to put that over there. This, the sassafras can go in bay number one because it's dry. I guess digging it out of here, you know, there's a lot of limwood. Is, Easier than going over there and then coming back here. Just got to do it. Sometimes you got to work for your money, folks. Sometimes you got to play games for your money. This is, now this is playing games. You, know, you got your hook rune You can grab more. Oh, well, we got we got a lot moved up. We might have to go split some of it and then come back here. I bet you can't do that again. Threw it and made it land on the side. And there that one goes. Yeah, like I say, I always tell Mike, I go, it's, you got to sort the wood. It's always better to do it before you load the truck and then doing it back here. Hey, live and learn. Oh, well, this stuff's dry. You know what? I might just set, Mike, I'm going to save this dry stuff for bay two. There, there, yeah. Yeah, grab the stuff that's, that's you know, semi-seasoned or green. That stuff. Put this right here. We'll and we'll put for bay, bay or may, bay one or bay two. That one, that one's dry. Go ahead, we'll leave that one here. But these heavier ones, these heavier ones need to go over here and sit and dry. The, this, that go ahead, grab that one out. These right here, sit. And we got it all moved. <laughs> Looks like the cut is acting up. <sighs> but, you know, Mike went 10 days without working. 10 days of playing games don't pay the bills. So, all right, we got those, we got those moved out of there. Now we can uh, get back to work. Gas is cash, John Manning. That's right. Oh, you're up. If you come across any dry ones, just throw them back in there. This one's, I don't know. Don't break the window. Oh, that won't happen. Daryl hooked you up. You're glad to have that, I bet.
Yeah, this is a good spot to dry the wood, so if it's dry, we're leaving it here. Didn't think about that till uh, got halfway through this, because yeah, once you get that, you f yeah, just throw them back, throw them back up in there, Mike. I'll let you sort them, okay? You decide if they're dry or need to. Yeah, that needs a little bit of time. Some of that cherry we're going to have to split into bay two or bay one. And there is some ash that needs to be split too. One popper. A nest of something in there, miles or something. Patty watching. Not very much oak in this. Might be enough to fill it up back there. Is that one right there with the mushrooms, is that oak? Yep. A little bit of mushrooms won't hurt. It'll burn. Now Mike will know better next time. You know, it, I, I, I always prefer just coming with like one thing, all, all oak or all ash or, you know, but if you do do mix, don't go more than two different spots. Right now we gotta go to three different spots for this stuff. You have to know, but now you know, now you know why I do it like that. How many people are watching? Oh, oh yeah. This is a nice piece. That was that was bundle grade. And Mike's bronchitis is acting up on him.
Double decker. into bay we're just gonna put it into bay one Mike got more leaves coming down With all your leaves falling down yet folks If all this cherry was dry, we would have just put it all in the bay one, but some of this needs to dry. This stuff wouldn't take that long, though. Is that it? Oh, that's sassafras. See any more cherry? We can get it on the way out if we find any more. That ain't much, so we gotta go. We gotta go back there. Get this out of the way. I'll drive back there. Like I say, no camera crew today. No Zach today. Zach didn't want to work today, Billy Otis. Or are you gonna drive it? There you go. Mike, Mike stepped up to the plate, so we gotta go get that oak off. We're gonna go where we were yesterday or uh, Tuesday. There you go, Mike. You see what? We, if you missed it Tuesday, this is what we got split. I don't know if that oak's gonna be enough. What he's got on the back there, it'll be close. But yeah, look at that. Isn't that nice red oak? Isn't that some premium stuff, John Manning? I think that's premium. Oh, he's got a hustle back here. Like I say, at least I got one person helping me, but then I gotta, I gotta turn the splitter around. You know, I gotta turn the split around and take it out to bay number one after this. He's gonna have to make room to let me buy. Then we gotta get my truck loaded up with my delivery for tomorrow. I wanted to deliver it today, but the guys out of town won't get back to tonight. Then that means I gotta do two deliveries tomorrow. Zero today. And I just had another guy message me and want to come pick up a truckload on Saturday. I gotta guide him in, folks. Can't have him run. Some of this is ugly, but it'll do. That's, you know, a lot of this just needs to be stacked. Not too much of it needs to be split. Might as well, I should have just shut the splitter off. Well, let's get it stacked. Yeah, just go ahead and hit the kill switch on it, Mike. Oh, well, like one percent of it. Well, not much needs to be split. There's Colleen, say hi to Colleen. Yeah, like two pieces, 50 this one, I guess. Kind uh, of there. You see watching too? 
NFL. They know we're going live. Daddy likes to do the live streams. Yeah, a couple pieces like this. You know, this stuff will still burn. Pretty, but I've seen worse. Wonder if Jack's watching. Wonder if you know Jack from Log Cabin's watching. line. Might have to cover this up. Call it full. There's a few more pieces. To get all that in there, it's going to be close. How we doing, fella? We playing games or we getting it done? This fast, he might have to go get his inhaler. He's like right here on the end. So I gotta keep walking over there. There's a couple that need to be split. See if he can do a double, double whammy. Let you see how much you got left. Here we go. There we go. Hi, Lino. Say hi to Lino. Lino. Say hi, Lino. here in Oak Alley. Got to keep it separate. The people who request this, a lot of people say, I want Oak, I want Oak. All right, we'll keep it separate for you. And these need to be split? Not really. Let's get them stacked. Come back to this side.
shut it off now. You know, we gotta go drive over out to Bay One and get all that uh, that stuff split. How dry is that stuff? That ash. The, so is it wet? No, it's not really. That's what I mean. Wet. They're they're not too heavy. You know how like when we get on film, they feel real heavy. Not like those. Not even close to being like that. Waterlogged? No. Yeah, waterlogged. That's what I mean. Yeah. Might put the on up. Looks pretty. Looks like it's about there. I got my line painted at. You know, what do you got? Like four. Yeah, you know, we could put the cover on. That's cherry. Oh, that one's cherry. That one slipped through. Hold on. That's covered up with them three pieces. I'm coming up this full. Cover it up, keep it dry, folks. So, got to do. You might find me some white oak I've been asking for. He knows it. He knows I have been. He knows I've been wanting it. I have one, which won't let me cut it. Four times the size yet. All right. Won't let me cut it. So, look what we got. We've got the cover on there now. Okay, Ali's getting filled up, Randy Clay. Filled up. Now that stuff's going into bait one. Well, I got more of that too where I was at cutting before. So I need you to get out of my way, Mike. I'm going to go ahead and, uh, I, I don't know. If you think, I, I just don't want that falling down. I mean, we could probably put it all the way down to here, but it's just going to be a pain. So I just got to walk back and get it, the, the camera. So I'll, truck, I'm. Out of my way. Can't hold the tripod and drive at the same time. I mean, I guess I could try. I used to drop it off that piece of cherry. Sorry, got to be fly. I'm gonna do it. I got to do it. One of us has got to do it. Work today. Zach wanted to play games, so. And when we got to move around like this, this is a, this is the thing about you know what, what I told I was telling them, don't bring mixed loads. They have to go into different spots because then we got to work harder. You know, it's harder on the ca doing the camera. Here comes the thumbs up. So he's gonna he's moving the quad into position, and uh, then he's gonna back his truck up to it. We're gonna get the rest of that stuff out. Then we got to split and load my truck after we take some of my brother's wood. So, you can see that's why I parked it there. So, you can see, you see what the, the cherry we got today kind of filled up in there. There's the dry stuff right there, Michael Volk. I don't hear you. I can't hear you, Michael Volk, but I can see your chat. Where'd he go? Oh, he's got to pee. He's got to pee every five minutes. Got to take his union break. Union break's going to be uh, letting liquid out, not taking liquid in. 
You gotta go, you gotta go, right? Alright. So he'll back right up to this. And then I'll probably have to gas it up. And I'm gonna, after we put wood for my brother in, then I'm gonna go over there and split that ash in. There he goes. Here he comes. There you go, folks. All right. That's good. Good. So, get this, some of these forward. I think he can use his, uh, you know, you got the uh, hook a rune? Okay. Gonna need that. No wonder why he's got to pee all the time. Drinking that monster. Drinking that monster. Take a union breaks. Yeah, I'll take one here in a minute. Don't worry, I'll get my union break in. Billy Otis, make sure of that. Let's just throw these. Can you get them past the splitter without hitting it? The only thing that sucks is you don't throw it too high because uh, there's that ledge in the way. Don't throw it up too high and wake up the wake up the wasp. Bowling for dollars. Bowling for dollars. Get most of this limb wood in here that doesn't need to be split. We'll split the rest of the ash and then uh, we'll probably end the video then. Because we got to do more moving around. Got to load up some of my brother's wood. Paying his bills by buying his wood. But I ain't going to do it. Buried in snow and ice. Nope. So we're doing it now, Mike. Unless you want to help me dig through it. Not really. Not really. Me either. That's some ash. People like loading from here because it's easy. Well, we're gonna give them some of this stuff. Should be dry. Should be. Right. Sits in here. It'll get dry. Yeah. I know it's dry and it's not. <sighs> Gotta spend money to make money. But I had Mike do a delivery for me yesterday. I got a forty dollar credit with him. So he's still taking all hundred dollars today. But then uh I won't need him. I gotta I got bills to pay myself. I gotta sell some of my wood that I have already here, cause we're going to Phil's. We're gonna go to Phil's and uh, and buy it. Uh, once they we get that trailer empty, and Michael, we're splitting into the truck. If it fills up the truck, we're just gonna split it on the ground over there, cause I, we need the trailer empty, so we can go pick up a load. I'll have you drive your truck over there and get it. Okay. Oh, he's got hickory for me too. Well, I got plenty. Yeah, I gotta take care of my bills first. I know. Uh, you know, I I wish I could uh, just sit here and buy from you guys all the time, Dude, but sometimes I gotta I gotta pay my bills. I wish people just take me wood. <laughs> yeah, you know, and it's just like I think I like stocking up. I know Phil don't like to stock up, but because you feel like you're working for free, but eventually you're gonna sell it. Yeah. Oh yeah. Somebody's stealing. Well, the guy, the guy's cutting the wood at, helps himself to Phil's wood. Just keeps taking loads and loads because they never reached the agreement. And Phil cutting that shares. Yeah, that says for us to dry. Yeah. Mix a little sassafras in, as long as it's dry. But we're about we're about set. We bring most of the slim wood out. A little bit less to split. Got some more cherry in here. That's probably not ready, but yeah, right here. 
Or I can just, we can split them, just double split them, and I'll walk them around to the other. I, I can walk. No, I'm gonna walk around on the other side of the barn. All right, you want to fire up the splitter? We're ready to go, folks. Done playing games. We got it. We got it all move forward. Yeah, you think that's dry? Alright, I'm gonna take these around the corner. Oh, well, let me feel them. Yeah, probably a little heavy. Get, split the other one, I'll walk it around, then I'll, you can just split for it until I get back. Let's see, I'll see how that dry that one is. I want to take chances of selling green wood, folks. Be right back. I stack. Need a unit. Oh. Hit that thumbs up if you think I need a union break. I'm working hard too. Not just Mike. Dry sassafras, that's dry for sure. Now this ash feels pretty dry too. Trying to get as much wood in here as I can without drawing out of bay one and bay two. I've already taken way more than I wanted to. But these guys got to keep finding it because, uh, you know, the weather's going to turn bad. But one good thing, once deer season ends, you can get back over at Eric's. You know, he's got wood back there. Oh, yeah, he's got that white oak log back there. That would easily fill up that rack. I had to give this one to mom. A little short. A little short there, Phil. How did Phil's load look that you brought you guys loaded up? Was it look closer to 16? Oh. about 20 more but most of them are one poppers we've got a double barrel in there too now this cherry's dry oh, Mike missed the layup I and throw parking for my mom there's a double barrel Thank you. 
together. Ken looks at mom, she likes it. Hit it. I made that one. Looks like that one used to be a bird's nest. Be a bird's nest right there. The tree finally fell over. Yeah, it didn't bother with a wheelbarrow, you know, I was trying to get the camera repositioned over here as fast as I could. go. You cut this one in half, right? The other one was just a little bit too small. Well, I don't know. Those look long enough. Go ahead and send those. We'll send that one too. We put the small one in there for mom. We're going to be having fires for a while, folks. Winter's not even here yet. We still got another month before the start of winter. But if we can get snow in November, believe that. Digging out the last ones. There's probably less than 10 left. Yeah, if he like brought a mixed load of all different species that was all dry, then it would have all went into here. But the uh, cherry, there was cherry and uh, oak that needed time to dry yet. So that's why it went over there. So this cherry, this cherry dry. See that, barkless? That's ready. Wonder when that guy on, uh, uh, what's that road? Uh, uh, about Cedar Creek Road? What's that? Um, Drake Road? Yeah. He's. You would think he's going to be need some soon. Oh, yeah. Can't for mom. Last one, folks. Go ahead or just uh, throttle down and kill it. We now we got to split into my truck. Now we got to get my truck filled for my delivery. So we got her all split. Um, like I say, my truck's over there at my brother's. You put this on. We'll put this on. Hope you feel better, Rogala. I hope you feel better, Rogala. Did you hear that? Mike's. That, oh, it came from Mike's mouth. But yeah, he said he's he's home. He's not in the ER anymore. There's Jason Lee. Say hi to Jason Lee. Hi, Jason. We got her all split. It's like you cleaned it out from last time. So we got some wood in there. You know, not that much in there. A couple cords maybe. But uh, you know, I got to keep keep having wood come in. And then, like I said, more cherry and hard maple. Yeah, that's what I thought I was gonna get today. And then uh, we got a bunch of cherry in right there. Just if you're just joining us, there you go. We got that. And then back there we filled a, filled, topped off a rack. So we get some of the king's wood. And then we're going to split the rest of the in the trailer. And then go over to Phil's and buy another trailer load and park it there. Then Mike can get paid and go home. And I'll be ready to do my delivery tomorrow. So. I guess with that, we're going to wrap things up. 
I want to say thanks for all the thumbs up. Thanks for people uh, sharing the video, making it to the end, and uh, everybody being nice except the haters. Uh, hopefully there wasn't too many there, and uh, we'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye, Mike!